This is not a series of random or isolated attacks. Rather, it's a systematic campaign to exploit the global economy through sophisticated cybercrime. Now that you understand the scope of this threat, here's what you or your small business or large organization can do to stay protected. The first thing you wanna do is ensure that you're doing identity verification. Implement multi-layered identity checks and use services that validate not just names, but also physical locations and employment history. Secondly, background checks in the same light partner with companies that specialize in international vetting to uncover hidden affiliations. A third thing, this is more security-based, behavioral analytics. Use tools to monitor employee behavior for unusual activity, such as accessing files they don't typically use or logging in from suspicious locations. The fourth thing you can do here is use a zero trust architecture or implementation. As much as it's a buzzword, the implementation is what is important. Limit access to sensitive systems based on role and necessity. No one should have more access than they need. Essentially the same as the principle of lease privilege.